So we're here guys, we're vlogging. Uh, and we're at the thrift store. So we're gonna show you a couple of things. So stay tuned if you're interested. Oh my, oh my. You know if you're interested? A lot of flowers, guys. It must be in the flower section. Oh, nice little coach bag. Thrift store. Steal, you know? Stealing is not good. Oh, I had this game. People have to do the right thing. That's why they have oh, these in cases. Oh, that one, that's nice right there. Okay, guys, if you like to read here, we have a... Bethany Frankel, okay? Skinny dipping. And this is gonna be only for 99 cents. Come get it at the thrift store, guys. Wow, look at this piece. This is a great piece for sale. Looks like voodoo. It's fantastic. This cute thing. I don't know what it says though. It's covered. Very cute, animalistic. You know, made in Japan. It's cute. Very cute. And also, look at this cat. Is ready, waiting for you guys to come get him mm -hmm. to go home. So that's all I'm getting, guys. So, and that's it. I mean, it's lovely, guys. A lot of unique pieces. I'm not, I'm not using this for my money. A lot of unique, weird pieces you can find for decor if you're interested. All right, I'm not, I'm not using this. Guys, if you're Raggedy Ann and Andy fans, Look at them right here, guys. They're waiting for you. Raggedy Ann and Andy, vintage, and they're waiting for you, okay? I don't have daughters, thanks God, but if you do have daughters, come get them at the thrift store, guys. Huge lamp selection. Cat lovers, here you go. Look at this. So this beautiful, unique thing here, lovely, might be on sale, guys. You know, art is great. You know what I'm saying? Art pieces are great for your home, and I love it here because they have so many options, and you can change them anytime you want. That's a good thing. You pay a good price and. You can change it anytime you like from what you see, you know? Vintage ones, look at this one. 1986, black theme. Meaning like the black borders and stuff like that, really Quite nice. Thrift because I like, you know, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I like, I have an eclectic home. My, my home is collected of things that you can't find anywhere. You know what I'm saying? Like you can't go just to a rooms to go or Ashley or anything like that to find the stuff in my home. And I could change it anytime I want because I get bored. So imagine if a person paid a thousand dollars for an art print, right? Obviously, if you spend a thousand dollars for an art print, you're not going to be changing it every three to six months because you're going to let it hang probably for the rest of your life. And who wants to look at the same painting for the rest of their lives? It's like being with the same person for the rest of your life. It just seems a little bit depressing. If you like flowers, it's available. Very bright. I got the, uh, the thrift and store. The it's really cool. It, well, it can't do, it has no batteries, but my, my mom has batteries, well, sometimes it does. Cheers. Cheers, I'm a water, but cheers. Though. All right, so the first thing that I picked up I have to learn how to where to look for the camera. The first thing that I picked up from the thrift store that you guys probably saw was this decorative plate. Gloria Vanderbilt, I already looked it up. It's from 1977. And I got it because I just feel like it's really romantic and just very pretty and stuff like that. Sometimes I like to, to uh, put 
decorative plates like on the walls and stuff on my gallery wall and stuff like that so that's why i got that one and i also found this one which i already checked and this one is from 1973 and i just thought it was adorable well, it says something that i like to say all the time which is have a nice day i say it to be sarcastic and sometimes i say it because i actually mean it and i thought it was really cute oh and by the way i paid for this plate right here it was on sale and the other one this was three dollars and this bigger one the gloria vanderbilt one oh look see it has even the, everything from back in the time uh this was four dollars because it was 50 percent off and then i got these that i happened to see when i was exiting these beautiful plates here this is from 1972 and it's two pieces here one of them has a handle here like this and the other one is like this beautiful color i just couldn't resist and the flowers in there is just like beautiful i could have my sushi on there i could have you know if i want to have something small to eat fruits or anything like that i just have it in this beautiful bowl because to me aesthetically when you're eating it should be in a pretty bowl i know some people are not into that they don't care but i do i like to eat in pretty bowls and stuff like that and take pictures of my food you know well okay so this other thing that i got real quick found you guys you probably saw me picking it up but anyway i did decide to get it was this beautiful um little trinket box here that i got beautiful trinket box i just got one recently that's coming in the mail that has um zebra on it you know i love zebra but this one i just fell in love with it because of the black and i just put it on my table you know whether it's in my room or in the bathroom the good thing about these kind of things like this you could just put them anywhere on the coffee table or anything you could put candy in it you could put nothing in it you could just use it for decor like i'm gonna use it and this was only two dollars no damages oh I probably damage it now i'm kidding i didn't damage it but no damages at all vintage from mikasa that's the brand and just pretty i love it okay so the last item i'm going to show you guys is this perfume i don't know if you saw it earlier before if you haven't i got this for myself i treated myself and i also got me a nail polish and this is perfume is from Vince Camuto, you can read. Smells very, it smells lovely. I don't even know. I just, I just saw it and I grabbed it and I just bought it. I didn't care because I just felt like I wanted to add a new perfume to my collection. Maybe one of these days I'll do a perfume, my perfume collection video so you could take a look. Because I believe you don't have to spend $500 and $800 on perfume. Now, if you want to do that, that's fine. But there's perfumes out there that smell just like the ones that cost $500, $800. But if you want to be like everyone else, copying on the internet and buying these candles and perfumes, go ahead and do that. Because when you grow up and you realize that those things don't matter, you're just paying this company these monies and you're just saying, oh, I have this candle from whatever the brand is. I don't even know what it is. But you know, if you watch my video, now you most likely know what kind of i'm talking about because you're caught up in the internet and you do all that but my followers and people that watch my video are normal like me so anyway this kimono look at it it's beautiful cute packaging and um like i said i love it so when this finishes i'm gonna go ahead and get a bigger bottle very soft lovely smell i love it I just love it. It makes me happy how it, how it smells. It's, it's lovely, and I recommend it. It's called, I told you already, it's called Fiori by Vince Camuto, and I do recommend it. So basically, um, that's going to be the haul, guys. He likes to videos make Videos ahead of time and make sure I show you everything. By the way, I want to mention this real quick. What I'm drinking is, this is what I'm drinking, guys, if you're interested. Uh, Seagram's Escape, Jamaican Me Happy. Okay, it, it has like droplets of alcohol. It's not good. It's nice. And I've never had it before. I just got it from Walmart. It was like a dollar and 80 cents. I said, let me try it. And guess what? It's really nice. Okay. A little switch from the wine. So basically what I wanted to show you that I almost forgot. The box was over there on the floor. Is I got me two uh, cups from Anthropology. If you watched my previous video... I had got a different uh, set where the pattern is different. 
So then I decided to get two of the other cups because the other cups have like blue flowers and a mixture. And I decided to get uh, two of these with the red flowers on them. Okay, and remember guys, when you buy things, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you're getting rid of things too. Buy things and get rid of things. See, these have red flowers on them. So I have a set of mugs over there in my kitchen that have red flowers too that I don't use a lot and they're smaller. They are vintage and I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna get rid of them, okay? Because you don't wanna have just, once you bring in, bring out, okay guys? Just, just little tip there. If you do that already, good for you. And don't forget to try this drink here. Okay, I'm not saying uh, condoning any kind of alcohol or anything like that, but I'm just saying this is very refreshing. If you don't drink, like if you don't like wine, this is really nice, because it only has 3.2% alcohol. And it's really refreshing, and I really like it, so I'm glad I'm, I actually picked it up, guys. So, have a wonderful weekend. I hope you enjoyed our thrift haul. And wait for the next video, guys. I'm going to show you the pieces, or you're going to pick up on the video the pieces that I got. And trust me, these pieces that I got is just... All I got to say is, I was manifesting a horse. I wanted to get a shirt that had horse print on them. And I manifested something else with horses on it. I'm just going to leave it like that. So, have a good day, guys. Thank you. And don't forget to subscribe. See you next time. Bye, guys. Bye.